What does being a part of Canadian mental health mean to you? It is core to my being and probably in many respects being alive. They have amazing programs here. They're amazing people. Helping people, uh, you know, live healthy lives. A big part of that is up here. And uh, if you can be healthy up here, I think the rest of it kind of naturally happens. We'd love to know what brings you here to the Canadian Mental Health Association event. So I am a volunteer with the Suicide Bereavement Group uh, with CMHA. I lost my 17-year-old son to suicide two years ago, almost uh, two years and a month ago. CMHA has been so supportive for me and for others that have used them that uh, I've turned it around and used it for volunteer time now. And I've been volunteering with them now for over a year and a half. So it's been a, a great healing journey for me. What do you do to make yourself feel mentally healthy? I like to listen to music. Music's a pretty important thing for me. Being around friends and family. For me personally, even if it's cold, I have to get outside. If I don't have some sunshine, even if it's minus 30, I go a little bit stir crazy. I'm a big believer of going outside. I like being outside as much as possible, as much in nature as, as I can. Talking you know, about it helps, yeah. right? Yeah, of course. It's the most important thing in the world to be able to talk to somebody about the things that are going on in your head. And when you do, you realize that, oh, you know what, there's a lot of things going on in other people's heads as well. It's not just you. you know? Do you think that um, stigma is being shattered? Do you think that things are changing? Or do you think, what do you think people can do to sort of break out of the silence? What could help them? Yeah, I think honestly, when you're in it, you don't really even know you're in it a lot of the times. And so people who are in your workplace, in your community, in your family, it really just doesn't take much to open a conversation and people are really scared to do that because it's like I'm not a psychologist, I'm not a psychiatrist, I'm not, you know, I don't have any special skills to deal with whatever this is. But it's just your fundamental humanity, just that caring, opening a door for a conversation that can help save lives and help get people directed to the support that they need. CMHA all across Canada is fantastic, but Calgary is a group of incredibly special people and do amazing things in our community. So, yeah, I, I can't say enough wonderful things about CMHA.